This episode of Six Five Guys is brought to you by Defiance Machine, defying tradition with innovation. Our Bros Rifles, precision on another level. JC Steel Targets, the industry leader in quality AR500 steel targets. Hi, and welcome to the 6-5 Guys. I'm Ed Mobley. And I'm Steve Lawrence. And today we have the mother load. It's the long-awaited and long-anticipated 6-5 Creedmoor Brass from Lapua. Yeah, so we just got this a couple of weeks ago from Graphs, so shout out to them. Uh, this is, if you don't have some of this already, it is shipping now and should be available if, you know, you're, you're well, they've got a container load coming in in like mid-March. Right. So then the, the channel should be nice and full. Yeah. So for this episode, we're going to actually be doing some tests and some measurements just to understand what this is all about. It's a little bit different than your typical 6.5 Creedmoor brass. has a small primer hole, a flash hole for the primers, and it does have your reputable Lapua quality. So we're actually gonna try and do some testing around the consistency as well as how long this brass would last in terms of number of reloads. Exactly, and with any pseudo-scientific uh, endeavor, <laughs> I, <laughs> I use the word pseudo, you know, our, our, our hypothesis going into this is because you've got that, that small rifle primer mm -hmm. and you have the, the traditionally stout Lapua construction, you know, we, we expect to see reloading life similar to what we see with 6.5 by 47 yeah. Lapua. Right. Now, anecdotally, we hear you know, a lot of guys with the current brass they're using for 6.5 Creedmoor getting, you know, in the range of about 78 reloads out of it. We'll see if we can actually push their boundaries on this safely and yeah. what we get out of it. Yeah, I mean, you, and, and most people say the reason why they're limited to the reloads is, is the primers get really loose. That's right. and, and, and again, all the other brass that's out there is large primer pocket. And... So our, our empirical experience with 6.5 by 47 is you can get 15 reloads easy. Yeah. And so, you know, we would expect that, you know, running a stout match load, you could achieve that with, with this brass. Yeah. So why don't you guys take, take a look and come along and we'll be right back. Again, 
noticing that the people who are taking the So, for the black one that we test again, we use a single case of each of the 40 bones for each of the years ago to each of the years. It's a very small black one. You can just see how the powder was kind of sticking inside the neck. This also means we don't have to have a clean rating Twenty second reload, La Pupras. No issues on the case. Okay. Ed, that's been a really fun day testing the Lapua brass. Yeah, and a lot of the details and, and measurements that we shared in this video will be in a detailed article on our website, 65guys.com. 
you guys liked this episode, be sure to give it a thumbs up on YouTube and share it with your friends on Facebook. And stay tuned for our next episode or upcoming episode mm -hmm. where we're going to take a look at the Alpha Munitions Brass. Guys, remember, life's an adventure. Stay on target. <laughs>